Tiny 11, a streamlined version of Windows 11, based on the 23H2 update, delivers the essentials for everyday tasks while minimizing the system's footprint. It includes core applications like Calculator, Notepad, and Paint, allowing users to perform basic computing tasks without extra software. Importantly, it retains the Microsoft Store, so users can easily install additional applications as needed. This version is ideal for users looking for a lightweight, efficient Windows experience without unnecessary features. For those needing more customizability, Tiny 11 may serve as a solid base with the Microsoft Store option, so users can build up from the essentials. It's truly impressive that Tiny 11's ISO file has been compressed down to just 3.5 GB, making it especially suitable for low-spec machines or even dedicated gaming PCs. With its compact size, it not only saves storage space but also helps systems run faster and smoother, particularly for older or modestly configured devices. Tiny 11 is a practical choice for optimizing the experience without the unnecessary software and features found in standard Windows versions. I'll guide you through downloading and installing this Tiny 11 version for your computer. First, download the ISO file. This is the first time I've seen a Windows 11 ISO with such a light footprint, only about 3.5 GB. After installation, it takes up around 12 GB. Click the link in the description below to download the ISO file to your computer. Currently, the developer has released a version for Windows 24H2. However, we'll need to wait a bit longer for the official release from the publisher. Once you have the ISO file, use the Rufus tool to create an installation file for Tiny11 on your USB drive. Insert your USB, then select the ISO file you just downloaded. Choose either GPT or MBR, depending on your hard drive's partition format. On the computer where you want to install Tiny11, access the BIOS to set the USB drive as the primary boot option. The shortcut key to enter BIOS varies depending on the device model, so check the specific key for your device, e.g. F2, F12, Delete, or Escape on many brands. Restart your computer and insert the USB containing your Windows installation file. Then, begin the Windows installation process. It's quite straightforward, just follow the steps I've outlined to complete the setup. For a low-spec machine, the installation should take less than 10 minutes to finish. You should format your drive to ensure there are no unexpected errors during the installation process. This helps to clear out any previous data or configurations that might interfere with a fresh setup. And that's it. The installation process for Tiny11 is complete, and it didn't take too long. Once again, I hope this installation helps you meet your needs for low-spec machines or provides excellent performance for gaming. Thank you for watching the video. Goodbye, and see you next time. Don't forget to like and subscribe.